Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Members, uh, I'm joined today with uh, Representative Arms and Representative Cooksey. Uh, perhaps you've heard of the phrase uh, six degrees of separation, and uh, we kind of have an environment today uh, when you start talking about some of these uh, relationships, uh, it doesn't take very long to you find out somebody knows somebody and somebody's related to somebody else and somebody's related down the line. And, and uh, we have one of those kind of combinations that are before us today. To your right, to my left, is a painting entitled Destiny Bound. It's a 2013 painting by Richard Wallace de Rossette out of San Diego, California. This was commissioned by a man by the name of Nino Martinez, August of 2013. And uh, it's in honor of the parents of uh, Nino, uh, Paul and Rosa Martinez. And that is the grandparents of Representative Don Arms' wife, Dee Dee Arms. So that's our first connection. Uh, we're gonna have Representative Arms introduce some folks in just a minute. Two of the five brothers, six brothers, that were all in the military. Lyle Martinez was uh, United States Army in Vietnam. Otto, raise your hand, Otto. Otto was uh, United States Navy and Air Force, retired. Nino Martinez is retired. Willie Martinez, United States Army. Paul Martinez, United States Air Force. And Diaz Martinez, Air Force. These are all brothers and uh, children of Paul and Rosa. We will have Otto speak to us in just a minute, uh, but we have another special guest, Ed Vesey. Will you come up here and come toward the center? Some of you may remember Ed being our veteran of the week. Ed is all of 93 years young. Come on up here, Ed. Ed went on our very first honor flight back in May of 2010. But more importantly, Ed was topside on the USS Oklahoma BB-37 on that fateful day, December 7, 1941. In the providence of God's hand, he was able to survive. He did have to jump into the water uh, and tread a little while, but he has lived all these years. He participated in three military invasions in the Pacific, the Marshall Islands, the Marianas, and the Philippines. And he is here today, and, and uh, we're gonna present him with a small replica of the large painting that is being donated to the house and we're not sure yet where it's gonna be placed, perhaps in our lounge. But uh, on behalf of the family, Ed, we're presenting you with this rendition. And Ed, after the ceremony here, will sign the back of the original that was painted and commissioned uh, in, in uh, August of 2013. At, at this time, I'd like Representative Arms to explain just a little bit more about the connections of the family and, and how it relates to our House and members of the House. Representative Arms, you're recognized. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. M members, uh, this, this is an interesting day because the Martinez family is a very old Lawton family. I don't mean you guys are old because you guys are pretty young yet, but uh, <laughs> my wife, Dee Dee, who's here with my daughter, Kelsey, today, they're up in the South Gallery. I just want to say hello to them. But Paul and Granny Rose, as we knew her, were her grandfather and grandmother. So, uh, and all the boys that are here, not, not all of them are here, but, but uh, one, two, three, four, five, six of those Martinez boys served their country in the military. And, and I believe Nino actually con commissioned the painting, right, guys? Eddie commissioned the painting. Okay. I couldn't remember. Eddie, Eddie commissioned the painting, but all the Martinez boys served their country. Uh, and, and another connection that you might not realize about this Martinez family is that... Jim Glover, who a lot of you see lobbying, he's, uh, he lobbies from Remington Park and all, and uh, I think the Chickasaw Nation 
uh, Jim Glover is also married to Linda Martinez, which is their sister. So, and he was the pro temp, speaker pro tem of the House of Representatives for a number of years, so there's a lot of skeletons in this closet. <laughs> Actually, it's a great family, and I've always been very proud of our association with the Martinez family. And I gotta say one thing about Granny Rose before I quit. She made the best homemade tortillas in the universe. So we appreciate the family being recognized today. And of course, we appreciate a piece of history hanging in our capital. And congratulations to you, sir, and thank you for your service. Mr. Speaker, would you recognize Otto to say a couple of words on behalf of the family? You're recognized, sir. We'll take that off. It's a, it is indeed an honor to uh, be here today to present this uh, painting to the, to the House, and to, the, to the state of Oklahoma. We're very proud that we're Okies, even though my dad was from Texas, but that's okay. Hey. Uh, but it is indeed an honor, and it's an honor to stand with this individual here because he's the guys, one of the guys that helped us do it. And I appreciate being here. And my mother's name is Rose. Rose. Not Rose. Rose. <laughs> but anyway, I, we appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Martinez. Representative Bands, you are recognized. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. And my apologies to Rose and the family. Rose. <clears throat> they will be in the lounge for a few minutes if you'd like to swing back there and get a photo with the brothers and with Ed. Uh, I'm sure they'd be happy to stick around for a little while and, and let you visit with them and greet them and extend uh, your congratulations. And particularly with Ed here, you can maybe some of you can watch him sign the back of that thing real quick. Thank you, members. Can I put on there, remember Pearl Harbor? Absolutely. You whatever you want. You, whatever you, put, you want. You put on there whatever you were there. You've earned the right. 428, 14. Okay. All right. There it is.